Hello and welcome to a new video. My name is Kit and I hope this finds you all in good health. We're starting at the High Street end of Merton Street and we will end at Merton Field via Merton Grove Walk. Now the beautiful building on the right is Oxford University Examination School. As the name suggests, many if not most of the Oxford University exams takes, take place here, especially the final exams. Hathaway is uh, wearing a neck brace here due to him having a fender bender at the start of the episode. That's not a spoiler, it doesn't give anything away in, as far as the episode is concerned. I'm not sure if the public is allowed into this building, but I'm certainly going to find out uh, during my next visit to Oxford, which probably, unfortunately, won't be until 2021. Now, I've done my best and uh, do not include any clips that could be construed as spoilers. Um, at least I, I, I don't think so. I've, I've included a few uh, clips from uh, the seventh series of Endeavour and I know that many people in America and other countries have not yet seen series seven but the clips I've included are definitely not spoilers and will not give anything away. Now I shot this video in April, the cruelest month. It was rather cruel because it was bitterly cold. <laughs> now this video is a bit longer than normal as it took me 11 minutes to actually complete the walk. This pink building, which is 18 Merton Street, has a heritage category. That means it's a listed building, Grade 2. Now this means that it is of special interest and every effort is going to be made to preserve it. Merton Street is one of the few remaining cobbled streets in Oxford. This is Merton College Fellows Garden, which is over that wall to the left. I imagine the cobbled streets may be listed as well, because I believe in Edinburgh we've still got quite a few cobbled streets and they are listed, which means they can't be torn up and tarmac laid or anything like that. They're a bugger to drive on, but uh, they're a nice link with the uh, with Oxford's past. Uh, you can see where some of this building was ripped out. I'm assuming just to make this lane, which goes to the side of the uh, Oxford University Examination School. damage to the cobble streets. I could be wrong, they may not be listed. It may be just a matter of the f it's too expensive to to lift them and tarmac the road, but I I'm I'm going to guess they are they are listed. On the left is, uh, of course, Merton College. It's a lovely college. Uh, I'll, I'll be, I'll be uh, making a video about uh, Merton College inside. Here's a clip from uh, Lewis' episode, Down Among the Fearful. The 
this is Logic Lane and at the very far end you can see the master's lodgings of University College uh, that was used as a location in the Lewis episode uh, The Mind Has Mountains they used the gardens and the, the building no one wants to hear your cat this brown door um, is entrance to known as Master's Lodgings of University College. Um, sorry, that's a lie. Of, uh, it's, it's, it's called Old Warden's Lodging, sorry. 7 Merton Street. But it's uh, not Warden's Col uh, Lodgings anymore. It's, um, it's a college library. You can see in the background in this scene here from Endeavour. Again, a beautiful building. Love to see inside. It's a lovely walk, and thankfully, the many times I've did this walk, it's rarely ever busy. So it's a nice way to avoid the busy high street which runs parallel to it. Another scene from Endeavour. That brown door on the right is where the HGV was uh, stuck at. On the left we're coming up to Merton College entrance. The main entrance. Architecture of these buildings, wonderful. And here we have Endeavour looking at his old alma, alma mater because uh, Merton College stands in for Lonsdale College, which is the fictional college that Morse attended. As I said, I've got video uh, of the college internally, so I will be putting that together because quite a few scenes from the Morse universe have been filmed in Merton College. Beautiful inside, it's just wonderful. But I do love I do love church architecture and this one is stunning. You can enter from Merton Street or inside the college. There, just past the iron railings, uh, that's part of uh, Corpus Christi College. And of course, Magpie Lane, as it says, on the right. And this leads up to the High Street. And again, there's been a few times it's been used as a location in the Morse universe. Now, the railings here is that, that's as the, oops, and here we have a clip where. Endeavour, yep. and that's it, oh, sorry, and we've got Morse driving down Merton. It's 
So if you look further down, that's down to the end of Merton Street. We're, we're now entering, about to enter these gates, which is to Merton Grove Walk. If you continue down to the end of Merton Street, you'll get to Oriel Square. Probably just to keep people off the grass. And this walk takes you down to Merton Field and Christchurch Meadow. Uh, it can also take you down to Christchurch College. Whenever I've done this walk, it's, it's never what you would call busy, which I'm glad of, because of course most of the main thoroughfares in Oxford High Street, the Broad Street, etc., are always extremely busy. Um, even when I visited in April last year, 2019, the main areas were busy. I'm always happy to do this kind of walk when there's not a lot of people around. So those iron railings, again that's the end of Merton Grove Walk. If you go off uh, to the right and straight down, that continues Merton Grove Walk and you'll meet with uh, Christchurch College which is on the very far right. If you turn left here at the, the railings and the gate, you'll go, you'll go on to what's called Dead Man's Walk. Well, thank you all so much for watching. Please take care. Now, if you enjoyed the video, please subscribe and think about visiting my website, which is about all things Morse, Lewis and Endeavour. And all details to my website and everything else is in the information box below this video. So please take care and stay healthy. Thank you. Thank you.